everybody, I am back with another video. My name is Monica Bolnez, if you're new here. I am an active Instagrammer and am taking to YouTube to talk to you guys about things that are a little longer than I can explain in an Instagram story or a caption. So today I wanted to share with you a bunch of stuff that I bought from Garage. If you follow me, you know that's my favorite store, clearly. <laughs> So I bought some loungewear, stuff to be around the house in quarantine, and once this whole quarantine thing does lift, things that I can go outside in and are still kind of comfy so that I can kind of transition into nicer wear and not feel like a bum all the time. <laughs> if you don't already follow me on Instagram, I'm gonna put my handle right here so that you can give me a follow. That's my most active platform. I talk a lot about physical and mental health and being your best self and living your best life. So what I'm gonna do is I recorded myself trying on the pieces so that you can see what they look like and then I'm gonna tell you a little bit about how I liked them. So the first piece that I tried on was actually a long sleeve ribbed crop top that I got so that I can wear it multiple different ways. I tried to focus on stuff that I can use in quarantine and can also use later. So something like this I can wear with sweatpants, how I did it in here. And I could also wear it later with jeans, I can wear it with a skirt, uh, with leggings, or pretty much anything. So it's a really multifunctional piece and I love it. I love the quality. It's not see-through at all. I actually ordered something similar from uh, Fashion Nova and it was really weird material and see-through so I'd rather spend a little more money and know that I have the right quality here. So yeah, I love that. Highly recommend that. The next thing that I got was a bralette. I got it in white and I got a size small. So that's just like a little lace bralette. It has no structure to it. It has no boning in it. Um, it's not very supportive, but it's really cute and it's really comfy since it's not super supportive. It's just something to wear under a t-shirt. As you can see in the next clip, I wear it under a sweatshirt. So just some support to be around the house, but nothing super uncomfortable and I love it. It's perfect. If you do want more support, I recommend sizing down just because I got small true to my size and it was like not fitted at all so yeah but I still definitely really recommend that that's exactly what I wanted so unless you're looking for something that's like a, a tight bra then then don't go for that the next thing that I got was a tie-dye sweatshirt. It has a little scrunchy waistband so that, um, I don't know about you, but for crop sweaters, I don't like when the air goes like up it because it makes me cold. <laughs> so I love that and I actually got it in a medium and it fit me perfectly. It was nice oversized baggy so that I can wear that around the house too. So loved that. There was nothing that I didn't love, by the way. Very rare that I don't love something from Garage, and I'm not just saying that. This is not a sponsored video whatsoever. I just really stay true to the brand and really love the quality. The next thing that I wanna show you that I paired with the tie-dye top was black biker shorts. So the quality of these biker shorts are amazing. I have them in gray, dark gray as well from Garage, and I love them. So I got them in black as well. They fit like a glove, and they're not see-through whatsoever. I got those in a small, by the way. The next thing that I purchased was a black zip-up hoodie, which I also got in a medium because I wanted it to be baggier, and it was perfect. It wasn't too short, it wasn't too long. The only thing I'd recommend is being careful with the zipper because I did like struggle a little bit zipping it up, and if you're not gentle, I can see how it would break. Um, but it was totally fine and perfect. So if you want to get something very like neutral that you can wear around the house and after quarantine, highly recommend uh, just a black zip up hoodie. The last thing that I wanted to talk about were the leggings. So I accidentally purchased them in a dark blue instead of a black, um, which I haven't really had dark blue leggings in a while, so I'm keeping them because I love them. And I'm definitely gonna be repurchasing in black because I got them in a small and I love them. I've been searching for leggings. If you follow me on Instagram, you know I've been asking you guys for your favorite leggings. And I actually purchased from Spanx, I purchased from Alpha, um, I tried a bunch of different brands. I also tried Fashion Nova. They were either see-through or the line at the bottom would like hit low, really low on my butt. So I actually show you in this clip that that does not happen whatsoever with these. I love them. They're thick. They're not see-through whatsoever. So if you're looking for a great quality pair of leggings, I highly recommend these. They are called 
the favorite and I can see why. <laughs> That's pretty much it. My battery is dying on my camera, so I'm trying to wrap this up really quick so that my lighting doesn't go away later. Um, I really hope you enjoyed this, guys. I know not everyone is shopping right now. Some people are, some people aren't. I know it's a really tough time and a lot of people have lost their jobs, but if you're really looking for some comfy clothes and kind of make your quarantine a little bit more enjoyable until uh, we're able to go back into the world, then I highly recommend getting a couple pieces to kind of I don't know, make your day-to-day -day a little brighter and make you a little happier. <laughs> I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you could give it a thumbs up so I know you're watching, subscribe, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.